snakes. I can't sing. I have horrible, horrible sinus drainage. Why can't we be friends? 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 It's because I eat all the chocolate, that's why. Hello everyone, how are you? Say something in comments down below. I actually do give a fuck. One fuck, no more. That's all I can afford to give. I, as some of you already know, am Katana. I am the Lightning Cat. And that reason that I'm chewing on is really good. Now! This particular episode of Warframe... Give me a minute. This chocolate's really good. Mmm. Mm. Oh yeah, that's good. Tenno, oh, has so begun. good. It will be marked on navigation. Shut up, space mom, Mortis. I'll go from planet to planet and do a whole five minutes. Just long enough to get a baseline for comparison and all the survivals. All the survival that I can possibly do in Warframe. I'm going to need a bigger gun. <clears throat> this is so I can get a baseline of how. The loot table distribution is working at the current time and date of uh, October the 28th, 2018. <coughs> Mercury. That's keep, kill fuckface. That's an interception. That's a spy, capture, rescue, right, crossfire, mobile defense, survival infestation, defense infestation, crossfire, exterminate. Okay. Apollodorus. 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 There, there we go. Apollo Level 6 to 11. I'm going to write down what I get for going for five minutes. Keep in mind, the loot is based on how many enemies you kill, not how long you go. Your mileage will vary greatly. Especially if you run a speed node. Distract the infested while Operative hunts for supplies. Not gonna Set bother with containers right now. A steady stream of toxic spores is being released into the area. Hold on. Emergency life support is inbound. Upvert a life support capsule to the area. Well, it would help if I could freaking aim. Totally spoiled myself with that arc of plasma. Look. He totally ran right into that one.
Come on, who's next? <coughs> I'm not keeping track of ammo, health, and energy orbs. Holy crap. Even more mods. Fuck yeah. Bizarre. Time to leave. Okay. <laughs> Four 
Okay. 46, 59 credits. And a cash of a thousand. Uh, 30 endo. One thousand eighty three ferrite. Two Datanite apples. And 124 polymer bundles. Okay, so ferrite and polymer bundles for, um... Wait, wait, I forgot to look at the frickin' mod cards. Okay. <clears throat> Mods that I got from that one. One Bane of Corpus. One Convulsion. One Speed Trigger. Two calculated redirections. Two regions. And that's uh, 198 kills. In five minutes. <clears throat> it took me 50 seconds to bounce to the exit, though. And that was on the mission Apollodorus on Mercury. D O R U S. Mercury. Okay, not bad. It took me fucking forever to write it down, though. That's the bad part. Because my wrist is complete bumpkiss. Oh, yeah, they all go. And I all go there, and... And the next planet is going to be Venusian Gardens. With hot and cold running champagne, apply now. Hold on. My camera's fucking funny. There we go. <coughs> Defense. Survival Corpus. Exterminate. 
Okay, there's two survivals on Venus. Right. Oh my gosh. Dark Sector Malva. Tenno, a new alert has begun. It will be marked on navigation. Okay, this is going to take a while. Malva, five minutes on this one. Okay. <sighs> Get a nice baseline going. For every survival to see which one is good at dropping which particular loot at this time until they do another update that changes it. Now, if they do updates that change it regularly, Then I have to keep doing updated videos. Oh, it just changed. Now it's this date instead of that date. Now it's doing this instead of that. Let go of me, Yankee. playing survivals with Necros because I believe that his Desecrate oh look uh, nice uncommon mod I believe that his Desecrate increases the probability of getting life support pod thingy chunks out of these Eminies I don't know if that's the case, but that's what I'm sticking with. Hey, Carrier Prime for the win. He shot both those guys. Look at Carrier Prime go. After I form in him and his weapon, he's doing all right. He's one-shotting level nine. And we'll see just how much efficiency I get out of him later on. Let me be, why don't you, babe? Set me free, why don't you, babe? You don't really mean it. You just keep on singing. Oh, that's a container. We gotta stay away from that. I don't wanna pick up containers. Ooh, another mod. Uncommon, too. Up a third mod. Oh my god, so much lucky. Hmm. 
A fourth! Oh my god, or is that the fifth? So much lucky today. Fucking epic! I love it! The camera adds 10 pounds. Fuck the camera! Another mod! Oh my god, so lucky! <coughs> there we go. Oh, got to turn around, he's dead already. Way to go, Carrot Prime! Fuck him up! Okay, yeah. The operative has just made their first mistake. Keep up the good work. Is this dark support on the way okay these were both infested I uh... <clears throat> 15,000 credits Fifteen thousand seventy four credits, fifteen hundred cash. Uh, fifteen and oh. Uh, hundred and thirty three circuits. Uh, 179 Polymer Mill Bundles. Two Fildron Sample. FIE. <clears throat> 517 Alloy Plate. One heavy impact. Uh, one speed trigger. One spinning needle. Two calculated redirection. One reach. Okay, now I need to take a look. The other one was good for ferrite. This one didn't have any ferrite drop. Uh, 
This one was okay for credits. Okay, and I need to see... 175 kills. From 175 kills in 5 minutes. <clears throat> now the other one... On Mercury... Was it infested survival as well? Uh, there we go. Okay, now it's going to be V Prime on Venus. is going to be a corpus c o r p u s yeah corpus survival <sighs> fuck this is going to take a while <clears throat> i'm writing all this down so that i can make uh, a log every year if they change stuff and then come back and plug all the information into a website I would love to build a website where I plug in all this stuff and I back up all my videos too I would love to do that your job is to distract the enemy <coughs> operative raids the ship for much needed supplies make your presence known my presence is known throughout the dark sectors as the Nigger Prime. I've delivered a life support capsule to the area. Activating it will buy you more time. Let him in half too. Barrier Prime, I wanted to kill those guys. I wanted to kill that guy too. Don't worry. Don't worry, It's gonna be alright. You just wait until the higher levels. Then you'll be demanding that Carrier Prime kicks ass. Where the hell did he go? Oh, that's where he went. Camera at 10 pounds. I would love to get a lens. 
put on to my Necros. I'd like to get a like nine of each greater lens. And just go through them one by one and get a metric fuck ton of, uh, of focus for all the focus trees. I was going to have been killing that guy. Why can't my companion kill count as my kill? Your life support capsule is now available. Why does it say rifle kills when clearly I'm using a shotgun? Hey, um, I have an idea for you guys over at DE. Instead of having it say rifle, you know, I get the points anyway for it with a shotgun. Why not just have it say primary weapon or secondary weapon or melee weapon kills? Would make a lot more sense logistically. <clears throat> Oh yeah, something else I forgot to say. My game is set to private, not solo. Invite only, actually. Where are you? There you go. I did not mean to blow that up. I meant to kill the guy that was in front of me. Three thousand three hundred ninety one. Um, one hundred ninety Indo, three hundred twenty three alloy plate. Three hundred and four polymer bundle. Uh, six field run samples. Three hundred and five circuits. And one Fury and one Reach. Out of 115 kills... Tenno, there's a time limit alert available. Check navigation. <clears throat> Write down everything I got. 
from how many kills? Okay, 198, 175, 115. Endo, endo. Yeah, okay, V Prime is a decent place for endo. What about alloy plate, poly bundles, and circuits? Alloy plate, poly bundles. Alloy plate. Okay, Malva for alloy plate. And uh, 3 or 4 poly bundles. Circuits, 1, 2, 3, 3 or 5. Yeah, V prime is good for uh, polymer bundles and circuits, whereas Malva is good for alloy plate. V prime's also decent for endo. Fuck yeah! From 115 kills in five minutes. Okay. Next one. Look at that. That was the one I was just at. Is there a survival on Earth? Spy. Interception. Defense. Capture. Steel Meridian. Exterminate. Exterminate. Cetus. Planes. Noble defense, ev excavation, defense, sabotage, mobile defense, assassination, excavation, sabotage, rescue. There are no survivals on Earth. got room right in here and right over here yeah you've got room to put at least one two uh, four more missions um, hey DE you got room for four more missions um, two at the minimum why not throw in a survival on earth it doesn't have a survival okay now Lua Crossfire Exterminate Rescue Spy Sur Corpus Survival Capture Defense Mobile Defense Okay So it's a tight show on Lua T-Y-C-H-O on Lua. It's uh, Corpus Survival. Level 25 to 30. Actually, yeah, I'm going to switch my weapon. I spoiled myself with the shot spread on the Ark of Plasmore. And, and I'm gonna get even spoil myself a hell of a lot more when I get vicious spread. <clears throat> now that, that ties into me wanting to be able to craft more mod slots for cards. Taicho, five minutes. Tunnel operative raids the ship for much needed supplies. 
I may have busted open a container or two. Accidents do happen. They nuked my shields. I need a fuck ton more armor and health and shields. Especially if I'm gonna solo this stuff. That looks like uh, salvage. Minions assemble. Let my minions take care of them for a moment. No, thank you. I don't want to fight those Sentry guys. Scouts. If they detect you, fighters will soon attack. Extract 
option is available if you need it. The op has just made their first discovery. Keep up the good work. Shit, there's a scout. Get ready for a capsule. Whoa. Don't have time to kill that. Twenty five hundred credit cash. Fifteen endo. Six hundred forty seven ferrite. Sixty oxium. Ninety one rubido. One detonite ample. One neurodes. Concussion rounds. One north wind. That's the southern wind. One ammo drum, one revenge. Out of uh, 196 kills, in five minutes, I'd say it's okay for credits and ferrite, <clears throat> maybe even oxium. has begun. It will be marked on navigation. Sabotage for an Ori helmet. An interception. I don't care if it was 6,000 alloy plates. There's no way I'm doing that solo. <clears throat> Infestation sabotage. Yeah, I'll do that. Telesto. Go for it. Get that and over and done with. Nice break and change of pace for things.
Fuck off, Chuggy bitch. It will only attack when it senses high concentrations of infested blood. Slow the fight if you want it to go away. A coolant cell has been extracted. Huh, I get berserk right then and there. That's amazing. Good for Juggy, bitch. I'll get that star later. As opposed to freezing everything solid or sockwood, as some might say, I'm gonna burn it up. Burn it up! Ooh. Rise, minions! I need you to defend me. And before one of the updates, uh, when you put the thing in to make it explode, it used to send a shockwave of fire that would just insta-kill you. Because it would, it would just be explosions every freaking where. <clears throat> now there's just those little patches of uh, burning stuff. Which are easily avoided. Glad they did that update. That was nice. Made it a hell of a lot easier to do this version of the sabotage. I just now noticed someone said hello. Well, if you're still there, hello to you too. Was that? Yes, it was. It was frickin' cells. Done with that bit. Titiana Araya helmet. Yes! <coughs> Whereas I like to call it a teddy bear. Oh, yeah, that mission right there, that was just a break from farming survivals. <clears throat> that is not getting written down as stuff that I've farmed. Okay, back to... Went to Lua. Okay, Earth didn't have a survival. Mars. Exterminate. Defense, spy, sabotage or capture, defense, assassination, rescue, mobile defense, capture, interception, exterminate, crossfire exterminate, survival, 
hijack, Tenno relay, sabotage. So, Wahiba. Okay, W A H I B A on Mars, which would be in infested. Okay, another thing that I would like to point out is the the variations of these uh, survival missions. A lot of them are infested. I'd like to see more variation, such as all three factions, Grenier, Corpus, and the infested. I'd like to see one survival for each of those three base factions per planet, just for variety's sake. Variety being the spice of life that it is. Here we go, Wabiba. Oh wait, it's the dark sector. Let's see. Infested. Dark sector. Corpus. Corpus. Infested. Another thing you could do with these mission types is actually have it cooperative multiplayer where you have one or two players do the surviving bit, distracting the idiots, and you have one or two other players actually going around the ship looting things. And they, they hunt for caches. not talking about in the exact same map, I'm just talking about in, uh, well, I don't know how to fuck to put it. Maybe in the exact same map, maybe they start off in different locations and, and you gotta keep them safe by avoiding where they are. That would be a challenge in itself. Or maybe you just have the same exact map, just one is overlaid on top of the other, like physically separate, like you're fighting in this one and then they're searching in this one. I can deal with that. I can either break that down into endo or sell it for creds. Resources are more than just regular resources to me. Man, 
After this, I may do farming 100 survival missions. Now that would be interesting. I farm 100 survival missions for 100 minutes each. Holy fuck. Ooh, ghost. Nice. I like that. If only it would work as fast as I want it to work, which is instantaneously. Oh yeah, uh, DE, all these mods, the, I've said it before, the mod card system is the, your game's meta here, so I would love to see it expanded upon, and yeah, I'll do a separate video talking about a lot more of what I would like to see. I'm gonna have to look up the wiki which has a list of every last freaking mod in the game I have to make a list check it thrice four minutes in okay still fiber fuck yeah Zero focus, darn, because it was on my weapon, my gun, not my sword. I got turned around for just a second. Ah, this end cap. This was good for camping. For <clears throat> okay, 19,171 credits. Holy fuck, that's a lot of credits. 110 endo. Three morphics. Oh, that's what it was. Two thousand fifty seven savage. Uh, da -da, da -da. Two gallium. Whoa. Well, that's nice. Two Fildron samples. And mods. One Fracturing Wind. I fractured some wind. Uh, two Calculated Redirections. One ghost. Uh, two halo reaches. One rupture. Two steel fiber. And that was from 267 kills.
in five minutes. Wow. I did that many kills and it only took me 55 seconds to bolt to the exit. Mother freaking wow. Mahiba on Mars. That's good for salvage. Definitely good for salvage. Let's see, Phobos. Exterminate, spy, <laughs> capture, corpus survival, and uh, infested survival. Stickney is a okay. Stickney. Stickney on Phobos. St uh, Ck. Okay. That's a corpus. O R P U S. <sighs> <coughs> it's also got a nightmare survival going right now. Vampire low gravity mode. Not gonna do that just just time. You can do it. Your job is to distract the enemy. A fellow Tenno operative raised the ship from much needed supplies. Make your presence known. Okay, what better way to make my they presence known than to shoot things? I'm sending life support capsules your way. Hey, bam! My presence is known. I killed a guy. Hello? I just killed one of your men! My companion killed the other one. Wow! He's saying wow because I'm using their own gun type against them. He's saying ow! They really don't like me cutting them in half. They're screaming about it too. Like, oh no, he's killing our men. Send in the droids. The fucking hell, I was right. They're sending in the droids. Life support on the way. Split him in half, and not in the fun way. For him. Another life support capsule is now available. Get rifle kills. Technically it's a corpus uh, energy shotgun. I don't see how you could classify it as a rifle. Hey, 
Hey, they're starting to learn to stay back and shoot me at a distance now. It's only a matter of time before they learn to send a bursa at me. Jamrat's ten pounds. Tenno, for life support. Affinity boosted. You did a thingy we wanted to see some cool stuff about. Congratulations. Come back here, I'm killing you. There you go. Blasted carapace. I'm not farming for that right now. I'm just doing straight up kills. As much as possible. Mother frickin' endo. Fuck the camera. Fuck the camera. Fuck the camera. I'm running really hot now. Fuck the camera. Fuck the camera. I don't wanna get caught. Fuck the camera. Fuck the camera. Ooh, fucking hell. Uncommon mod. Actually, it's silver level. And then the brownish ones are bronze. And then the yellowish are gold. And then the the fucking purple ones are freaking. What are they again? Ribbons. They don't have any platinum ones. Oh wait, they do. The platinum colored ones are the freaking primed mods. I'm a fucking idiot for forgetting that. Fucking hell. Four minutes and fifty-seven. Yeah, it's time to leave. Extraction is ready. The raid is off to a successful start. I'm counting the bits I get from the the thingy. The caches that the Uncovered. 2793 credits. One hundred endo. One seventy three Rubido. Forty plastids. Two shotgun savvies. Ooh. Fuck yeah. It's VVY? Huh? Really? It's spelled with two V's? Smite Grenier. G-R-I-N-E-E-R. -E -E fuck it. I'll spell it however the fuck I want, okay? G-R-E-N-I-E-R -E -E is how I spelt it. Fuck it. Who cares? One ammo drum. <clears throat> that seems to be a good place for credits. Tenno. There's a top fit admission alert. 125 available. kills in five minutes. Okay, now for the next one on Phobos, which is Dark Sector that I know for sure.
Zygma! Zygma! Okay. Z E U G M A. Wait, on Phobos, P H O B O S. On Phobos. It's infested as well. Okay, there we go. We're gonna do this one. And bus we, I mean me. I'm gonna invite a dude to my party. Because I need someone to talk to because my brain is going numb from repetition. Hey, whoa, damn. Fucking, I got the thingy loud. Keep talking. Huh? Well, uh... Huh? Wow? I don't know. Help. What? I don't know. You had your microphone I didn't like. Say it. Who did what? I don't know anymore. That was. That was an entrance. It was loud for a second. Okay, I don't know what that was though. Hmm. Oh yeah, so I finished leveling up Ash Prime, and now I moved on to Alice. And while I was doing that, and while I was doing that, I found two frosts. And it was bad. Well, kind of. One of them did what I asked them to do, but then everybody left at wave 5. Mm. Um, and then the other one had enough range so it didn't really affect anyone. So, mm. yeah, because if, if we would have, if I, if they would have put the bubble in the same spot we did, uh, it wouldn't have worked. It would have covered like half the half pod. the map. <laughs> no, half the pod if you put it there, because it wasn't like that big. It was fairly big though. Ah, you did include your audio, now I'm just didn't you? Uh, yeah, I did, because I actually saw you broadcasting this time. <laughs> Unlike Yay! last time, because you started broadcasting after I left, and I didn't realize that you had started broadcasting because you never told me. And I didn't notice because it never told me that you did start broadcasting anything. So that's why that happened. Ah, uh, yeah, that's okay. No worries. Can you take a stab at what I'm doing right now? Not really. Just, Hold on. Just guess. It's more of a novel concept, but at the same time, it's for gathering information. Wait a second. What the heck is that level? Oh wait, where are you? Phobos. Oh, I can't even get to that because I can't beat hecking Kepler. I can help. I haven't beaten Kepler yet, so I can't even get there. I'll help. Oh yeah. Yeah, that would really help. Oh yeah, uh, so, what extractors do you have? I've got the Titan, uh, the Distilling, and then I have the Distilling Prime. I need to get the Titan Prime. So do I. How what do you get the Titan Prime? Titan Prime? It was with something that you had to buy, so I'm not okay. entirely sure if you can get it anymore. We'll just have to wait until it rotates over again. What the heck did I put on Atlas? Hold on. 
I need to remove everything that he has on him. And redo it, huh? Yeah, because it's not the stuff that I want him to have. Hold on, what does this look like with Atlas? Another life support is now available. Okay, that just doesn't work, and I'll, but I'm not going to use that because I don't like it. Whoops, I blew up a container. That's going to muddle some of my test results. Oh, what were you going to do? Were you going to do the entire mission and then at the end of it just break every single container? No. I'm oh, trying to do missions containers? without breaking any containers right now. Try and guess what I'm doing this for. A rhythm. No. <sighs> it's outside of the game. But it, it's for stuff that's in the game. I have no idea. It's a novel concept. Get ready for a capsule. You know, uh, how you, you see videos, oh, the best blank for blanking blank. Can you fill in some of the blanks? Yeah. Spin the wheel of the fortune best. and see how much you get. The best way to... The, the, the best way for farming is fucking... I don't know. You got one word correct so far. Polymer farming. Bundles. No, Polymer it, it's, 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 not, it's not for polymer bundles. It's, it's for farming, but what is it farming for? Wait, hold on. So you're on Phobos. And on Phobos, I think there's circuits, but I don't remember. Oh no, it's plastids. Alloy plates, more fixes the veto. Uh, I don't know. Maybe plastids? I uh, am. Um, no, no, it's not for one particular thing. What I'm doing is I'm seeing which survival missions give you what items and in what quantities of those items to determine where. You can farm Tenno, for them. Prepare for life support. Ah. And I'm I'm also gonna redo it if it changes. I'm gonna redo this whole freaking video every time they change it. Or I'll just redo it annually for the sake of keeping it up to date. For everyone to know where to go to farm what and in what quantities you can expect for your baseline. It's a novel concept, isn't it? Because they're going to change it every year. We, well, I assume, I guess, that they'll change it every year. <laughs> I don't know for sure. Yeah. Hold on, what happens if I put <clears throat> Atlas's energy to blue? 20,561 credits. I want to see what the heck happens when I put Alice's energy to blue. <laughs> you think he's gonna have make blue his balls? If it makes his rumblers blue, that's gonna be hilarious. But Frank yeah, he probably Cash. will, to be honest. Um, two seventeen Rubido. Goodbye, cat. <clears throat> There's one thing I need to test real quick. 40 plastids. So what, are you just going for like five minutes? Yeah, I'm just doing five minute runs on every survival that I can. One more fix. One forty-seven. I forgot plate. that's what... <laughs> I forgot that's what my uh, Kubro looked like. You forgot? Really? Yeah, very, very... One convulsion? Red. 
because I haven't used my first Kubro in so long that she's Seems still at level trigger. 18. Level 18? Uh, 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 yeah, she's uh, still level 18. Does she have four strength, four stam, leather collar? Ah! Uh, what? <laughs> this is a fucking World of Warcraft joke reference. What the fuck? Oh, the, yeah, then I wouldn't know that. I don't <laughs> oh know my what, god! Uh, okay, when you I get don't the opportunity, play Warcraft. look up four strength, four stam, leather belt, World of Warcraft. F try to find the original. Because he nerdgasms so hard on it. This fuck. Level 18? Four strength. Oh, oh. <laughs> dude, dude. It sounds four incredible. Strength, four stam, leather belt. Ah! Oh, level 18? Oh, oh. <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. It sounds terrifying. It's fucking hilarious, because. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm gonna die laughing, because you have no clue. Two speed triggers. I need so much platinum for weapon slots specifically. Because I need have both, five man. weapons. Five ruptures? God what? damn. What? You and me both, dude. We both need platinum for more slots. One swift death. No, I mean like weapon slots. Because I have five weapons that I have waiting to be built. And right now, all I want to do is make the Ak Jagar, or whatever the heck they're called. To do that, I'm gonna have to make... Kills. Let's see, I'm gonna have to make two Bolto. Then I'm gonna have to make the Ak Bolto. Then I'm gonna have to make the Dual Stanas. Then I can combine them to make the Ak Jagara, which I've been told are incredible. All right, 241 oh, yeah, kills in five the minutes. Stiletto into the Axomati. It took me a minute and 44 Whatever seconds is. to get to the exit. Damn. Hmm. But that's a lot of credits. 20,000 credits? It's a dark sector on Phobos? <clears throat> I have a Volnus ready. All right, stick me in Zugma. Right, Zugma and Phobos is nice for credits, and Rubido, and possibly. And then there's Gap plates. Two. Yeah, Gap, Gap Two. Gap Two in series. five minutes. When I went, when I went for like five minutes with a credit booster, I left with over a hundred thousand credits. Yeah, you will get a lot of credits farming on Gap Two. Yeah, and then the next time I did it, I left with like 15,000 credits at, at the end of like... Okay, there's two minutes, survivals. Like, One is Draco on Ceres. Yeah, Draco... Draco's okay. It's mostly Grenier, though. In Gab 2, you get a lot of I'm stuff from... Guessing. Yeah, okay. What's the thing? Oh, Mutalist Allied the fifth? Oh, no, that's Rekord. Never mind. Not the... will be marked on navigation. See, so it's a spy secondary only. Ha! My secondaries are crazy. Rescue with that, and then a mobile defense with radiation hazard. Now that's where a frost would be handy. We found a way, it's everyone. There. We found a way. And... Were we recording at the time when we found a way to make frost bubbles actually useful in a defense mission? I don't know, but the last time I tried to make two people do it, uh, one of them, one of them was like, okay, no questions asked. And then the other guy put it around the thing, but because of the amount of range it had, it covered like the entire area around the thing, so it really didn't matter. Why? Range increases the bubble size, so once you get enough range, it becomes a non-issue at certain uh, defense missions. Yeah, but you can also use frost bubble on that to uh, get a, uh, a ribbon done. What's the ribbon? 
don't remember. I don't think it was. I don't remember what it what it was, but it's a ribbon that makes it so that like you're not supposed to make the uh, the defense target take any damage. I think I don't know. Oh, the, I did, the I way to unlock it move. is that you can't let the defense target take any damage. For what five waves? Yeah, or the whole ten or I what? don't know because I don't I don't have the ribbon. It was just a thing where the frost said that they were trying to do. So I was like, oh, okay. How'd you get in here with me, that... asshole? These Life fuck colors look nice. I like the Silver and Ages, dude. It's a pretty fun weapon. Silver and Ages? Yeah. Is it that flaming sword and shield? Yeah. Yeah, it is. It looks pretty good, too, don't it? Yeah, and then when you do the slammy thing, it uh, releases a little fire burst thing. With Ember, it's pretty good. It's complimentary really to Ember, isn't it? No, because it doesn't mention Ember, like, at all. I don't think. No, the, the shield and sword that you're talking about complements Ember as a weapon set aesthetically. Yeah, and it really helps her because it basically does her, like, what, third ability without having to use energy, but it's on a way less, it's a on a smaller less large scale. scale. There is a way you can get, yeah, I, don't I know. think there is a way, I'm not sure, but a mod card that increases that. Seismic impact, I think it is. It's something to do with your uh, slam attacks. It's a mod card. I don't remember what it's called. I'm gonna have to look it up. Get ready for a well, here, if I just go into my. Uh... Yeah, what did you say it was? Seismic Impact? I think that's what it was called. Or you just go to your, your melee cards and look through it that way. Okay, Seismic Impact is not a valid linkable item. Oh. Just put in the letter I and search it and see if it, it gives you impact or something. I forgot how to spell, spell seismic. Ooh. Yeah, me too. That's why I just said go with the, the letter I for impact and we'll see what comes up. We have shattering impact, sun impact, molten impact. Shattering storm, disruptor, no contact, those are just things. Yeah. Read the impact yeah, let me, ones. Let me look at shattering impact. That's exactly what I thought it was gonna do. Alright, so melee. Alright, well, that's not there. I'll just go into melees and see if I can find seismic. Extraction is available if you has just made their first discovery. Keep up the good work. Healing return. 
Yeah, that healing return is good. What does it do exactly? Heals you for each status type, affecting the enemy by yay so many points for each status type. Tenno. Life support. Hmm. I need to subtract Seismic 192 wave. credits from my final tally. Okay, 4366. Four, six, six. Minus 192. Picked up that 192 after my five minutes was up. <clears throat> so that's a four. So that's a seven. That's a one. That's a f okay. 4,174 credits. Alright, let's see. What is this? 80 endo. 200% melee slam damage. Yeah. And then there Jesus. should be one to increase the range. Uh, there should be That's a card from... called Reach that increases your range. That should expand the seismic slam impact. That's draw from the Bailiff, Transmute, and the Tusk Reaver. Alloy plate. Hmm. Augur Strike, okay. Uh, five Detonite Ampules. Finishing Touch. Let's see. Voltaic Strike. Virulent Scourge, Vicious Frost, and Toxic Light. Enduring Strike. Gleaming Blight. Enduring Affliction. Spring loaded blade. That's probably dropped from okay, the. Okay, that uh, blue what, pigment. I can't count that. that. That's for a clan thingy. Pressure. Quick point. return. Whirlwind. What does that do? Uh, read it. I can't. Not until I do this. One hundred and seventy kills. There we go. So now I can read what it does. It. Oh, it's just projectile flight speed for throwing melees. I want to see what Gleaming Blight is. Whirlwind. Projectile flight speed on thrown melee. I have yeah, two of those. Fuck yeah. Seismic wave. I have one of those. Gleaming Blight. Let's see what this thing does. 16 shattering impacts. Status chance and plus one Blight. That's oh yeah, from that's from the uh, that's from faction. Those guys. Yeah, it is. I see that now. Blight is your uh, status gain with those guys. Voltaic Strike... Violent Scourge. Draco on Oh, that drops from, from that guy. One. Which would be Gab 2 series. It's a dark sector. Let's check what Virulent Scourge does. What does this do? Virulent Scourge is toxic on melee. I think it's Yeah, melee. it's toxic and status chance. Yeah, it's one of those... Which means that's also what Voltaic Strike is. And probably you, Vicious Frost. You you get the toxic... Not, not toxic. You get the status element uh, mods for melee and your other weapons from doing spy missions. Actually, Violent Scourge says it also drops from the Corrupted Guy in the Void. The Corrupted Vor in the Void drops this, the, uh, the, the toxic versions. That's the only exception to the rest of the whole thing altogether. Augur Strike. What does this do? Augur... I forgot what the Augurs are. Those are the, one, those are the new mods. Well, new... 
mods that came out with the Plains of Eidolon. Yeah, you can tell because this one's only dropped by the uh, Mutalist, or by the Eidolon Gantulist, Mutalist Incursions, and the Razorback Armada. Oh my god, All right, yeah, the so fucking I Eidolon. Right <sighs> we need a team with the best equipment to go after the Eidolons. We, we just need to stop pussyfooting around with our fucking modamps on his ass. We really need a team with badass shit to go and take him down. <clears throat> well, let's see what August Strike does. Puncture. Okay. That's all it is. It's just a ton of puncture. You must provide cover for a lone operative. Set off the alarms and keep the infested busy. But yeah, so reach increases your range by a lot. Avenging truth. Rift, rift strike. What the heck is that? Is your only chance for survival. Hmm. I've delivered a life support capsule to the area. Now I know for a fact you probably do not have 42 alloy plates. I really don't think you have rift strike. No, I don't. I know for an absolute that I don't. Yeah, because it only drops from Kayla to Thame. Charge attacks now step through the rift to attack enemies up to 25 meters away. Jeez, so what's that, the twin vassal lock? The heck are those? Twin vassal lock. I don't know what it is, either. Oh, it's these things. I want them. Because they re they... They, Jesus, they have 40% status chance. And they at also their look base? Cool. Yeah, at their base, they have 40% status chance. They're gonna be status monster builds, that's for sure. Yeah, especially considering that their critical chance is 5. I've delivered another life support capsule. But yeah, they actually do look pretty neat. I want them now. I don't blame you for wanting something that's that freaking good with status. I remember how I was saying that I didn't have anything for a health return, and now I do. <laughs> All you need now is a rejuvenation. Oh Jesus, that that takes a lot, actually. <laughs> to get one? Yeah. So How do you get it? Two control modules, right? 30,000 credits, a dual Zorin, and an Atom. For a rejuvenation card? No, for the Twin Basilisk. I already have a rejuvenation. If we both run our Necros builds. Or if you run a Hydroid build specifically for Pilfering Swarm and I run my Necros, both run the Rejuvenation, we'll be able to do that for nearly indefinitely. Because it'll keep me alive. And I'll be converting energy and shit back and forth. What's that card that does the energy back and forth with the health? Additional life support has arrived. Uh, equilibrium? Yeah, if you run that and I'm running that, we both run rejuvenation, and I'm converting, like, all the corpses into health and energy orbs, we'll be there nearly indefinitely. Kicking ass and forgetting to take names. I forgot what the Atomos takes, but I remember an Argon Crystal. Yeah, it takes two Argon Crystals. 
And a ton of polymer bundles. And by a ton, I mean like a thousand three hundred. Dude, we can it, farm so that really... in like six minutes. Yeah, but let's well, see. Not, so right not now... literally six minutes, but we can farm that pretty quickly. Especially since I'm doing okay. this just to see where we can farm stuff and what we're gonna get farming. So, Life support incoming. to get the twin basil off, I'm gonna need two argon crystals and a ton of polymer bundles. Because I can already make the dual zord, so I'm gonna do that. Hold up. I have an idea. Right I also down. have. Write down exactly how much it's gonna take and what it's gonna take. I can just tell you. No, write it down. And then add it all up because I'm busy doing this and writing stuff down from this. I don't have a piece of paper though. Just take a break and go get a piece of paper. Biggie. Well, it's only gonna take 1,150. No, no. No, it's not. It's only gonna take 1,050 polymer bundles, about. And two iron crystals, so. And then for the Bolto, it's gonna take. Like. What, 600? 6. 600, 550? About? Then all I need for the phone prime is that receiver, which I would like. I'm gonna go do that actually. See if I have a receiver from the uh, Euphona. Euphona. Life support on the way. Well, it took me a full minute to bust to the exit. 23,960 credits. I have three relics for the Euphona Prime receiver. Those are all Axie E2s. Sixty-five endo. Okay, the alloy plate. Yes. I have to take away some alloy plates from the total. I don't think the Axie E2 is for, is vaulted yet, but it might be. It should be because Banshee isn't vaulted, is she? Okay, 696 uh, alloy plates. It, even though I opened a canister and got 342 out of a canister for alloy plates, that's not bad for an alloy plate farm. For right. night ampules. Yeah, because I do need alloy plates for some stuff, I think. But I'm not entirely sure. Okay, good. So the circuits. Euphona Prime is not vaulted yet. So I could easily get it from places like... Oh, I can get it from Amara. Or Hydron. Or Brahina. Or Selkie. Uh, from Eris. Choose the Malazar, highest level area. Ostrus. The highest level area would be Mott. Okay, that's where you gotta go to get it. But it's also dropped on the uh, Kuva Fortress, Tavayuni. That could help. Mithra, Bellinus, Despina. Yeah, no, I think I might just go Mott for this then. But yeah, I have three Axie E2s. You can see how many you have in the clan chat, because I posted it there. It'll tell you how many you have. Oh, for fuck's sake. 
One fracture. Like I've just been posting mods and stuff in the. In, yeah, like Rift Strike though. That seems like fun. But it's like 25 meters away. Does that mean I can that's throw nice. the dual Zorins? So that's gonna be fun. Redirection. You know, I'm I'm. I'm just gonna go into the One uh. Quick draw. I'm just going to look through melee weapons and see what there is. But I can just buy right off the bat. <laughs> One region. Oh, he's got the bolt ace. One rupture. Which require the Cronin and the bolt or which I can get easily. Uh, um, One steel fiber. Raza. I can't get those. Ether Reaper was fun while I had it. I think I mastered it, didn't I? Yeah, I don't need that anymore. Fragor, did I master that at all? Don't get rid of oh. it! What, the okay, Ether Reaper? Gab 2 and Draco. Draco, yeah, we did that one. Okay, oh, I one, can buy two, Galatine. three, four, five, six. Alright, I did seven... Seven planets. Including Earth, which didn't have a survival on it. Okay! I got from Mercury all the way up to Ceres. I'm gonna finish the rest of these much later. Holy oh, yeah. fuck! It takes a while to do this shit. It really does. Yeah. And then there's people who edit Crowning. their videos of doing this shit and compress it down into like five fucking minutes. Oh my god, that's insane. I forgot about the Magistar and how I can turn that thing into the, uh, the freaking Cybear, which requires 30,000 cryotic. And 50,000 alloy plates. For a hammer that has. 50,000. Holy oh yeah. fuck. The best thing about it is the fact that it has a base of 130 cold. Okay, Otherwise, dude. it has 10 status and 50 Tell critical, everyone so it bye bye. And we're finish our okay. conversation. Bye bye persons. <laughs> right, thanks for joining me, everyone. Till yeah. next time, fuck right off.